Shri Gurubhyo Namaha. The most awaited time has come now. A hearty welcome to all who have gathered here virtually to witness the virtual curatory show of class five of the PSBB Millennium School, OMR. Let's begin the program with an invocation to the Almighty. That was divine indeed. To say that we are thrilled to see you is an understatement. The year saw its own challenges. The pandemic situation affected each and every individual from different walks of life. For children, it was a unique challenge when they had to interact with the teachers online. It was a heartbreaking moment when we teachers realized that we could not see the wonderful children of our school. But thanks to the support from the management and a dear principal, we are ensured of our interaction with our children on a regular basis in a week. With the limited time we had with our children, they showed their might by adapting to the online mode for the classes. And it was not just the classes, but events, competitions, and celebrations that went online in the PSBB Millennium School, OMR. Needless to say, our co-scholastic activities too went online with the art teachers reaching out to their children in the virtual platform. We welcome you all to a glimpse of the work put up by class five. We cordially welcome to our dear principal ma'am, parents of the school, children, and a distinguished uh, guest, Mr. Abhinav Yagnik. Art is unquestionably one of the purest and highest elements in human happiness. It trains the mind through the eye and the eye through the, uh, and the eye through the mind. As the sun colors flowers, so does the art colors the life. We present you the memories of the art classes, uh, glimpses of the art classes of the PSBB Millennium School OMR.
the little hands doing such wonderful pictures paintings color combinations isn't it beautiful yes it is very beautiful and it reminds me of my childhood when we were learning you know how to draw and all so it reminds you also of your childhood how you used to hold the paint or the pencil in your hands and used to draw and the teachers used to guide you right so now i call upon um, mrs gitanjali nathan the level guide of class 5 to deliver the curator's note good afternoon to all art is like silent poetry it teaches the significance of life art means expression and exploration through colors lines and dots it also lets our thoughts and imagination go wild in this pandemic year children have explored their creativity and imagination over online platforms yes. color pradarshini this art exhibition showcases the colorful work of children still life or portrait speaks volumes about a person children of class 5 or the exploring squad they have created their imaginary world using colors lines and shapes their thoughts and observations go beyond and are limitless being creative is not a hobby it is a way of life with such budding thinkers and artists from our psbb millennium school oemr children of class 5 have created a body of work that showcases their creative thought process mediums used and wide imagination during the period of 2020 to 2021 thank you thank you gitanjali ma'am artists are just children who refuse to put down the crayons here are the little artists of the psbb millennium school oemr with their artwork while you get to see the artwork of the little children i would like all the uh, students and the parents to give a big round of applause to the children of class 5 as they exhibit their work every artist was once an amateur and here in these past pieces we find a future like uh, michael anglio davinci or ravi varma <laughs> Now you are going to see the artwork of the students in class five during this pandemic, uh, during this online classes. The performances, the creativity, the color combinations. We are going to get to have a glimpse of the artwork of the students of class five. actually ma no problem children please enjoy the art that the children are uh, it's been shown to you look at the art look at the creativity apart from your art art you can see the artwork of the other students other friends you can enjoy you can improvise on your work also i'm enjoying watching it
my 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 i just can't believe that you children are so creative wow i wish i could be one of you who could draw such lovely uh, drawings i'm so happy i'm so happy beautiful creativity beautiful thoughts excuse me ma'am i'm yug yes uh, you you can just enjoy the, uh, the artwork ma yug you please mute your audios you don't have to unmute and speak ma'am can you let me in with my another id yes you you can ma'am no ma'am uh, it's telling that uh, some can you let me in ma'am you you can join you can join in another id also no problem i'm just enjoying the creativity the color combinations the neat work the imagination so beautiful it is so beautiful a big thumbs up to all the students who have done so beautifully i can see all the eyes focused on the artwork so beautiful it is isn't it yes very pretty very imaginative very creative please mute your audio please
It's such a pleasure for to the eyes.
your hands together, children and parents. It was a lovely, wonderful exhibit of the artwork. Excellent, excellent. I was in the process of learning, thank you so much. Thank you so much. In the process of learning, we as teachers would like to improve our students' performance. Your valuable suggestion would help us to raise the bar from good enough to even better. We thank you for always giving us a good feedback. Now, we request a better feedback for better teaching. So now we are going to uh, listen to a few feedbacks from the parents and students. Art is not what you see, but what you make others see, said one famous painter, Sri Guru Pyo Nama. I am Tamil Akhilan Uday Kumar of Class 5C from PSVP Millennium School, OMR. I have always been amazed by art. My sister introduced me to it when I was less than 3 years old. I watch it and watch her draw, color and paint. Soon, I begin to draw too. Now, I make use of all the opportunities to amaze her and bad prices. All of this was possible due to the support of my teachers and parents as well. I take this opportunity to thank them for their mentoring and encouragement. Art is more than just my hobby. It has become a part of me and my identity. It gives me pleasure and makes me happy. It has strengthened my creativity and boosted my concentration. Mom, you're not able to hear the recording, ma'am. Just wait, children. Yeah, we'll just of all the different types of art that I've learned and tried, what I love the most is pencil shading. I also love the vibrant colors offered by oil pastels and watercolors. I always try and make time for art. I request you all to do the same too. So friends, spend time with art and enjoy its benefits. Thank you. Hey Guru Bhiyo Namaha, I am Vaibhav of class 5A from the PSDB Millennium School, OMR. Today, I am here to talk about the importance of art in our education. Personally, I am very fond of drawing and I love to challenge myself and play around with colors, be it oil pastels, watercolors or paint. It spreads a positive vibrancy in all my activities. We are blessed to have our art teacher this is Runu Singh, who gives us opportunities to express ourselves and enjoy the process of learning. She teaches us very patiently and I enjoy the art classes. My favorite work done so far is the self-portrait. It has helped me concentrate more and focus on minute features well. On conclusion, I would say that every area of academics is important and art for surely helps us in our self-development. Thank you. I am Ajitesh Gurdik studying in class 5B of the PSBB Millennium School OMR branch. I would like to share my experiences with the art classes of my school. During the regular classes, the art class is a much awaited period of our day. The pandemic, we thought, drew a much loved for scholastic classes out of gear. But much to our surprise and delight, the school arranged for classes online too. Our art teacher made sure that we could continue to have enjoyable classes in this online world too. During this pandemic situation, we have learned different drawings and coloring techniques. I thank our principal and all our teachers for giving me this opportunity. She would have grown up her. Good morning everyone. I am Uday Kumar Ganapati, father of New Tamil Akhilan of Class 5C from the PSBB Millennium OMR School. First of all, I thank the teachers and school management team for giving this opportunity to speak with you on this great occasion called Art Exhibition Day. As we all know, art enables each one of us to provoke our thinking process and communicate with others. 
on the feelings or the messages that we want to convey with others via one or other forms like drawing, dancing, singing, acting and etc. I am also glad that my son got passion towards sketching, drawing and painting. I thank the art teachers and the school management team for their continuous support and encouragement to make him to learn about the art activities on a regular basis. Art is, is a platform where individuals can channelize their energy to create amazing and creative output which gives a lot of satisfaction and excitement to the individuals. And also it makes the individual to be self-sufficient, self-disciplined uh, and time managed and be a creative person. I am sure that each one of us might have learned about art in the past and continue to demonstrate that on a regular basis. Let us also encourage our near ones and dear ones to do the same. I am sure that these younger and super younger talents will be the newer icons of older faces like Davinci, Picasso or Hussein. Draw your thoughts to draw happiness in and around you. Learn the art to earn the benefits in your planet. My best wishes to the amazing talented kids, parents and teachers. Thanks for the result. Have a great day. Thank you so much. My name is Ganesh Janikiraman. Father of Vaibhav Ganesh, studying in class 5A, the PhD in Millennium School, YMR. Today I am here to speak about the importance of art in education. How students can use art as a platform to develop themselves as successful individuals. Art can help in many ways. Primarily, creativity, confidence, collaboration, cultural awareness and empathy, and critical thinking. Let me touch upon each of these points briefly. Creativity. The nature of art as an activity is such that, that it promotes unique thinking, the ability to think outside the box and this particular quality is very much essential for students to distinguish themselves amongst the crowd. Collaboration. The nature of art activity is such that it often involves individuals to work in teams, collaborate with each other, develop a sense of camaraderie, team spirit and this is a quality that students need to develop early on to be successful in life. Confidence. The nature of our activity or the platform that art as a stream provides to individuals is a sense of accomplishment when they achieve a particular task and that sense of accomplishment often rubs off in their academics as well. Cultural awareness and empathy. The exposure and the platform that art provides students is such that they are exposed to various cultures, various uh, race and it provides them to uh, opportunity to question them, trying to understand the various beliefs, uh, trying to understand the struggles that people have gone through to accomplish things. And this aspect is very much needed uh, in, in the, as they move forward in life, is, this, is the ability to empathize with others. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. I'm Dr. Vidya Shankari, mother of K. Ajitesh Kritik of 5B, studying in the PSBB Millennium School, OMR branch. First of all, I would like to thank our principal ma'am and all our teachers for their tireless efforts taken towards handling this entire academic year of schooling through online classes and also for their well-planned and well-organized execution of the same. As I was asked to speak a few words about the co-scholastic classes, I should say that each and every student would have felt so happy for having their art classes also included in their timetable, just like the regular physical school. As a parent, what I observe is that my son used to very much look forward for these art classes every week and he enjoys them a lot. Art education connects the students with their own culture as well as with the wider world around. It actually boosts their self-confidence, increases their or develops their um, skills, their motor skills, it develops their creativity, their imagination and much more. And hence, it wouldn't be correct on my part if I don't extend my sincere thanks to all our art teachers who are handling these kids so lovingly and bringing happiness into them by making their classes very interesting 
especially during this difficult pandemic period wherein these kids are very much missing their play time with their friends once again finally i would like to thank the school for giving such a wonderful education during this pandemic period just like the regular school not leaving behind anything at all thank you thank you dear students and parents uh, among the uh, we have somebody who were a parent who wanted to give her feedback ma'am can you uh, give your feedback ma'am anyone who wanted to give the feedback about the art classes no yeah ma'am i'm purnima a uh, parent of uh, sarvesh sp of class uh, 5 yes yes ma'am yeah actually uh, the first of all i would like to uh, thank all the art teachers and the uh, school management for giving such an opportunity for the kids during this uh, uh, pandemic and uh, i would say that my son has developed a lot in art because he uh, uh, to be very frank he uh, he never loves art or, or any form of drawing but now uh, in this pandemic he started to draw uh, by seeing others uh, artwork and how they portray themselves uh, he uh, started to draw and i'm very much happy that he uh, he has developed the interest in art so thank you so much ma'am for this welcome thank you thank you so much thank you uh, dear students now i request uh, we have with us mr abhinav yagnik he is the art fest mentor i would request mr abhinav yagnik to uh, give us to give his uh, uh, valuable words to share his valuable experiences and thoughts to all the students and the other uh, parents over here uh thank you ma'am thank you for uh, such a warm welcome and thank you for inviting me here and uh, shri gurubhyo namaha to everyone present here respected principal and children parents and my dear art teachers um i think looking at these uh, presentations gives me uh, quite a delight how the children have explored and uh, also i was reading the chat boxes chat box that who wouldn't love art as a child everybody loved art and it is and as an as an adult when we are we have grown up but then still there is always a love for art uh one where one also there are, there are no rules and there are no certain uh you know uh you you are allowed to make mistakes so of course everybody loves art hai na so um i am really delighted to see the amount of work that have we uh, we have got and uh it's a beautiful presentation a uh, beautiful work that everybody has done uh which also made me wonder like during our own time when i was a kid when i was in a uh, when i was a child uh in fifth grade or fourth grade in school never got a chance to explore like uh for example if someone would have asked me to make a portrait of myself the only thing we would have done was circle two dots and a smiley whereas you look at this presentation all of you the budding artists who are present here all of you have done you have observed yourself you have you have taken such good care of you know uh, detailing it out with all those um, all your features uh, using uh, different mediums and made it so vibrant so um, so it was it's really mesmerizing to see with uh, in such a young age uh, all of you have developed some or the other skill maybe not uh, you have, like one could see the attempt basically the idea is not to see uh, how realistic or how uh, you know pretty the portrait or any artwork has made but the attempt the true attempt of making it and also to understanding that particular concept is a very good uh, is one could see one gets uh, that gets reflected in the presentation so uh, that was uh, so it was quite wonderful to see uh the amount of artwork not only portrait but also oops i shrunk myself that one project so i would like to uh, ask uh, the art teachers um um arunu ma'am or ashwara ma'am if you are present and if you could hear me yes. i would like to ask you how did you enable children to 
you know because this is online it is not also offline it is online where you conduct art classes how did you uh, enable children to you know come up with such uh, such creativity while uh, they were making portraits sir for portraits mainly we have done with pts hmm. we have first uh, we have shown some uh, artist work and then we have talked about that and then we have discussed all the point more like whatever their likes or dislikes or whatever they have to show it that portrait or they can see themselves in the mirror or mm-hmm. their childhood photo anything they can choose they can touch and feel their uh, features and they can try on the paper so main, mainly we have gone through that to bts bts so it worked a lot sir okay so that's interesting you not only ask them to see uh, look into the mirror or from the photograph but you also ask them to touch their features touch their faces well that's an interesting thing ma'am um, thank you so much and uh, what is this uh, oops i shrunk myself if you could uh, talk a little bit about oops my oops my shrunk i am quite curious to know sir about oops i shrunk myself like uh... they have to think as their size uh, they are like the and very tiny size and the world is like huge in front of them like if they are very small too small and how they will see the world it will be very huge everything will be very large mm. so they mm. have to think and imagine and illustrate on the paper so 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 how did they manage to imagine all of that i mean uh, that, that by way. giving some ideas by giving some ideas like and if the ant is seeing the world how it will be like that we are giving some some examples oh okay now that's interesting we have asked them and we have asked them to just imagine and just uh, share their views also yeah just, like we discuss uh, about the views and then we have make them make them to start making the sketches after that flat diagram well i mean that completely changes the perspective of the uh, viewing the world completely like yes sir yeah so th- that was one of the projects that stayed uh, while i was uh, obser- uh, looking at the presentation thank you so much so um it was it was an amazing presentation and also of course not only children but also teachers have taken such great effort and they have come up with such um uh, methods so that children could explore children could you know think and go beyond what uh, really exists so um, i would like to thank uh, all of you and uh, it was pleasure watching this uh, entire presentation and all the best all the very best uh, since you are we you will be promoting you will be getting promoted to 6th grade and then 7th and so on and so forth with your education please don't leave making paintings keep doing art it's a fun way to explore and uh, make life colorful so that is what i would like to say and uh, all over to you ma'am thank you so much thank you so much sir for your encouraging words now i request our dearest principal ma'am mrs rukmani sridharan to address the gathering and present us with her words of advice shri gurubhyo namaha Uh, thank you mr abhinav for uh, making it your august presence here and uh, thank you parents and children we could see your excitement as uh, sujatha ma'am was speaking and so many of you were disturbing her asking me so many queries hmm, which affected her flow of thoughts as well anyway children are children and adults are adults we appreciate your curiosity and interest thank you parents and we are really sorry that the chief guest was not able to make it due to some emergency situation and uh, some prior commitment we are really very sorry about it and yes amazing work by our students good old the art first team a wonderful job we would not have it is not possible for us to see to see the creativity of the students without the support of the parents because everything has been done at home although we have conducted online classes it is only because of the support extended by our dear parents that 
we are even able to have an occasion like this so thank you very much for encouraging us it is really a motivator for all of us and also thank you students and thank you teachers and more importantly mr abhinav your mentoring really added a lot of value to what we have been doing so thanks to you also personally and i just would like to convey to the parents and the students please don't think art as uh, something less important and it is not so important when compared to academic subject actually truth is it is a skill and if your children are able to hone the skill and learn and improve it is definitely going to help them in improving in the other subjects as well it is really going to give them a lot of concentration and it is definitely a chess buster too amidst the heavy subject that they study so please encourage your children we really we are upset when we look at the number of children present for the art and craft classes and i know personally how many messages i have posted in triplearn pleading and requesting all the parents to ensure that the children attend the art and craft classes the attendance was never full for the art and craft classes or for any course classic subject for that matter so kindly encourage your ward skill it is very very important as in the words of mrs ygp ma'am has always been a great supporter of the course classic areas whenever we go to her that uh, this child is not doing english then she will ask okay is he good in music is he good in art is he good in dance please encourage him to do that we don't know so today the fact that many of the leading artists leading actors and actresses are from mrs uh, ygp ma'am school from psb we no wonder because ma'am encouraged post scholastic on equal pedestal as scholastic as academics so that is the truth that is what we have learned and we also truly believe that we must encourage all this post scholastic because we do not know there might be great artists turning from our own children so please do encourage them and support your children and support the institution also in our in all our endeavors thank you very much good house to everyone thank you ma'am for those encouraging words now i request uh, aishwarya ma'am to deliver the vote of thanks shri guru bhi namaha it is indeed an honor to present the vote of thanks to all those who are present here for kala pradarshini we would like to thank our chief guest for taking time of the schedules and gracing the occasion our heartfelt gratitude to our principal for being a pillar of support and guidance and giving us this wonderful opportunity our sincere thanks to our mentor mr abhinav sir and coordinator mrs raji rajeshwari ma'am for always being ready to help and give us suggestion we would like to thank our teachers for supervising the submissions and our parents and students for their enthusiasm and hard work thank you once again ma'am thank you ma'am that was uh, that was indeed very good i thank uh, each and every one present over here for making this show a wonderful uh, show thank you so much we will end over here have a nice day everybody thank you so much shri gurubhyo namaha